It's been almost a year since voters passed the DeWitt School District's $66 million six-year bond proposal. When I last spoke to Superintendent Shauna Spickard about a year ago, the district had a long to-do list for those dollars. So I wanted to check back in to see what they've been able to check off the list. We have a team here within our district that meets every week for about two hours. They've been hard at work. Just look at this brand new Memorial Stadium. There's also partial new roofing at the high school and a new maintenance building is currently under construction. And a lot of the work they've been doing, you can't see yet. A big issue that we ran into this year is campus-wide power. And so for us to be able to do the type of mechanical and electrical upgrades that we need, we need to have power. And um, the power that we have now is not up to not up to code. Spickard says the part they need to get it up to code, a transformer, has a lead time of up to four years. We obviously can't wait four years to have uh, the transformers that we need to, to be able to make the updates. So their team continues to brainstorm while staying within budget. Spickard says getting air conditioning in all the schools is a big priority. Reporting from Your Neighborhood Into It, I'm Lauren Shields, Fox 47 News.